put him in his bag. So you gotta get him with both hands. They said that he gets his water from the bath. That I've seen myself with a family definitely feels surreal. Um, I didn't ever think I wanted to be married. I throw him in the pool and I'm no, I no. But I did want kids. I always saw, saw myself with kids. And I think when I think about my relationship with Swiss, um, that's surreal. You know, we're coming up on our 11th anniversary. 11 years, and we're like, what? The universe just kept, like, bringing us back together in different ways that's super unexplainable to this day. Like. Definitely. At least 10 to 15 events that you just can't ignore. Definitely. Yeah. And with Swiss, I found my equal. That's when all the pieces that felt like they were missing and all the parts that felt like they just didn't quite fit, boom, it all just came together. I now understand the bigger picture because, you know, we have kids and growing up with your kids and just spending those amazing moments together. That's like the best times. Goes on the bottom like this. Yeah. Okay, guys. Close your eyes. Close your eyes. You know, we have to be role models in our house first. It's not really like an outside thing for me. Mm. All right, you guys ready? Yeah. One, two. Aww. 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 That's me. You know, we got our straight. Let's go. Who's going to get it? Let's go. We got our communication in order. <laughs> we got our goals in order. We got our love in order. There it is, right here. No, oh, that ain't it. This is it. His lens tissue. <laughs> <laughs> I guess it's trippy because you know we just, just both just turned forty. And we're very like just at the beginning of our whole life. We're super young because we started music in our teens. I was probably 14 and he was 15. I thought she was gonna fight me. She had on a purple Columbia jacket and, and some Timbs. Her girlfriend was in my class and she used to always rap. And then one day I came outside and she's like, yo, this is Swiss BJ. And I tried to get her number. She never gave me a number though, but um, came back strong. <laughs> <laughs> came back strong like a hundred years later. Yeah. We've been in the musical circuit together, and I think I was focused on my thing, he was focused on his thing. I read an interview about him that just annoyed me to death, that he was like, he just writes music in 10 minutes. And I was like, <laughs> I was like, who says that? Like, who would even say that they write music in 10 minutes and be proud to say that? Like, ugh. Me. <laughs> when I first met him, it was like, five chains on, all diamond outfits. I didn't think we had anything in common. But I think that when we started to actually get to know each other, that's when I realized that a lot of things that I thought about him was not who he actually was. And so when I started to actually uncover what he was about, that's when I started to realize, like, wow. Ladies and gentlemen, I got a million ways to get it. <laughs> She was one. She was one. Swiss is like a force of nature tornado to the music world. The music that he makes, it literally sets you on fire. Like, you can't even stay still. 
And the crazy thing is you don't even know half the stuff he did because he's done so much. One thing's for sure, if I could play the piano like my wife, they asses would be in serious trouble out there. <laughs> they have problems with me just off of analog, like <laughs> machines. Like imagine I could play what I'm feeling or play what I think and have that, oh, it'd be, it'd be superhero. He really is Showtime. He is the Zai, Zai, Zai. He's the Zone, Zone, Zone. He's all those things. Zai, Zai, Zai. Zai, Zai, Zai. Oh, Zai, What exactly is Zai? Everything. He literally, in the best way, thinks the entire world revolves around him. Like, the entire world. He can't understand why they don't get it. He's like, I don't understand why that's not happening. And this, this has to happen. And there's something so brilliant about that. I'm spontaneous times 10. And she's crazy enough to do these crazy ass things that make us crazy ass happy. Exactly. That's for sure. Mmm. Yeah. I think 11 year anniversary is bigger than a 10, right? Because it's parallel lines. Right? The 11 is like a parallel line, and we graduated the, the parallel lines of life with each other. I love being married to you. The best shit I ever did in my life. I really love being there. It's perfect. I hear your voice and it's all around me. All around me. I love when you come. I feel open to feeling whatever I feel. I don't always find myself sharing whatever's happening with me. But Swiss, he's definitely my go-to, like, touchstone even with music, how does this feel? Like, if I, if I need to get a second opinion, it's his opinion that I trust. That's, that's the energy level we're looking for. Okay. Energy. I'm energy. all I ever wanted. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. And there's a brightness to it, too. Super Let's bright. Let's it changes the tone. It opens Sometimes I'll find myself kind of leaning toward what he might think, just because that's my natural tendency. I've had to come up sometimes, and I'm like, this is a great idea, but it's not my idea. I, I don't exactly like to volunteer my feedback unless somebody's asking for it, because... That's the difference between me. I'm volunteering all the feedback. <laughs> I'm overwhelming with the feedback. He volunteers his feedback at all times, under all circumstances, even when I don't really want it. Because you told me to. And I like it. I do. You said, don't say something after the fact. Oh, I hate that. He definitely is somebody who helps me think about things through a different lens and in a different way. I also have to be leery of making sure that whatever I'm doing I'm doing it because I really want to do it. I have to honor myself. I like to give out space. Let a person get in their vibe. Let a person, you know, I give my opinions. Like, babe, do you think you should change the drum on this? And she like, I got it. <laughs> Can I hear this louder? Is this too low for me? Yeah. I think, like, a lot of times, People think they own each other because of a ring. She's her own boss, I'm my own boss. Like, we don't own each other. We're not competitive. You know, we, we, we just have two whole different lanes. Like, we're not even trying to occupy the same lane. Yeah. That's actually what works really well for us. 
I know the hours that I have to put in in order to succeed. And I know the hours he's gonna have to put in. So if he's sleeping over at the studio, I'm not tripping about him sleeping at the studio. I get it because I understand his pattern. I know his flow. You have a good sense of like space. And it's not space where suddenly I feel like jealous or he feels as if I'm not paying him attention. I love that we match each other like that. Can we get the shot? We need a wide shot. Man, the fact that we're shooting this song and it's an anniversary as we speak is just, it's just, it's just a representation of our love and, and, and the universe around our love. Mm. You know, she's in a wedding dress with a bouquet. I super love this. Can I keep this? are an extension of each other. We like have the same whatever. <laughs> what? Ooh, look at that sun going down. Come on. Look like a ship. I see a ship. I see a ship. I see. It's a glass bottle with a tube, and it's red. You know, I'm a changed person. You know, I was super young, moving fast. Didn't really have a lesson on fatherhood, being a husband. You know, my wife, like, accepted all my kids. That was, like, big for me. Look at my babes. Where'd you go? It was always something that I was battling with, like, from day one. Yes. For her to come in and, like, treating them, you know, just as well as Egypt and Genesis, like, that's how all of our kids was treated. Like, for me, I was like, this is what I'm looking for right here. I feel like now I have a super understanding partner that I've been through things as well. And we both know what we don't want to see again. And we both know uh, what we want to work on uh, to move further. And I think that's like been like the best thing. It's like learning from our past, accepting our past, and moving forward with our future and accepting that as well. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I love it. <laughs> Swiss is like the ultimate manifester. He definitely has taught me about magic. You do have the right to dream what you want to dream and expect it to come true. I'm just inspired to be on my board. To be like the greatest I ever been. To be completely uninhibited. Just in all of my glory and greatness. I'm so ready to just blow my own mind. I want to blow my own mind.